Hi everyone, I'm Lisa Renee Jones, also Lisa Renee Harrison, because I'm married to... Diego Harrison. Yes, and so today we are starting a segment that I'm really excited about called Internet Tuesday Internet Trolls. Tuesday Internet Trolls. Yes. So we all know all those people on the internet who, you know, you post something like, I love pizza, and they post something back like, stupid bitch. Right. Well, maybe not to the actual poster, but they start having interactions with each other. Like, oh, yeah, I love pepperoni pizza. And then somebody says, well, probably because you look like a pepperoni or something like that. Yeah. And they fight each other. Yeah, and it's like constant. It's everywhere. So we thought it would be really fun to start pulling some of those and even try and apply them to real life to see how effective they are. So, but we're going to start with, we thought, oh, I mean, come on, it's political season. and Everybody's so nice to each other during political season. Oh, yeah. That we should at least, we should try and pull some of the nice examples so <coughs> we can at least say, you know, when you do hear the bad ones, you know, there's some good communication going on. So we're just going to basically, I've got a list and Diego's got a list and I'm going to read mine and he's going to reply with one of the random posts, no particular order, right? Okay. Okay, so here we go. So... <clears throat> What the hell are you blabbering about? Don't skip leg day, bro. <laughs> okay, I don't even know what that one means. I don't even know how that could apply to any sort of political conversation. I don't either, but yeah. But uh, just don't skip leg day. Okay, and uh, Bimbo, I must say I about fell on the floor that you participated one small thing <laughs> finally to this entire conversation. Even though you got it wrong, at least you put forth a little bit of effort. Nice try, foreign troll. You're on crack, my friend. <laughs> oh, you sound just like another naive, weak-willed, appeasing Democrat fucking goof. Well, you're a pussy then. Oh, <laughs> you need to look in the mirror when you call somebody stupid. Only a stupid person believes that. <laughs> Bunch of pussies here. Kill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Bimbo, I don't even believe you served the country. You're so stupid. Shut up. <laughs> well, that was kind of lame. Yeah, that's kind of a bad one there. <laughs> Hi, my name is Alvino Bilbo. You have a nice profile and I like it. I wonder if you would be free to chat and get to know me. Please add me and let's chat. Yes, this was in the middle of a political conversation. But, I mean, come on. <laughs> when you've got a chance to go hey. for it, you've got to go for it, right? Yeah. Okay. Your turn. I, actually, I have another one of these. Oh, shut up. Again? Yeah. Okay. Well, MSNBC is missing an idiot laugh out loud. Run along back to the Minion page. Have a Snickers. You get so angry when you're hungry. That is true. That really is true. <laughs> you need to get on your meds. Oh, is it? I thought she was talking to me. <laughs> um, you are making too much sense. He can only translate stupid. There's a word in my pork and pork. <laughs> pork and cheese language for what you are. I, of course, I don't know that language, but there's a word for what you are. I'm actually, uh, oh, here's one. She's a freaking witch. What the hell are you blabbering about? Oh, I think I already had that one. Forrest is a troll. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually out of them, but I, I have one that I found that's kind of weird, and this is it. Can I, can I give you a good rub down with Kentucky Fried Chicken Grease? <laughs> I don't know if that was just an insult or was he coming on to somebody? Go suck off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I've got several more. Pretty but so highly dumb. How do we even live? Laugh out loud. Oh. And it goes on. Only a stupid person believes that. There's all the ones I read. Yeah. <laughs> wow. That, they're funny, but I think I can imagine while you're on the... And in the, if you're in this exchange, you get heated and you kind of lose your your focus and you start saying things like, don't skip leg day, bro. But don't skip leg day, bro. That is know. like the worst insult of them all. <laughs> I mean, don't, I mean, is that something like saying you're dumb? Does that mean you're dumb? Maybe that's one of the, something the kids are saying nowadays. Or maybe old people say. No, I don't think it's old people. 
Okay, so we're gonna try their techniques and see how it works for us. So, Diego, you go. I can't wait till we get the new tires on the car. You suck. Yeah. <laughs> what are you blabbering about? You don't crack. <laughs> uh, well, I don't want a tr uh, new tires on the car. We don't need new car tires on the car. I still don't understand why. It doesn't snow that much. Don't skip leg day. <laughs> Fuck you. I don't know if that was ever said. <laughs> <laughs> you need to look in the <laughs> That's mirror. That's a little Lisa that skipped out on that one. <laughs> <laughs> no, come on, convince me about the tires. Because see, this is a thing, you know, when you say these things, it really helps convince you. So, convince me that we need the tires. You're just a freaking witch. You're an idiot. Um, you need to stop smoking crack. I'm still not going to agree to the tires. Just don't skip leg day. <laughs> Anyway, that was our first edition. Wait till you see the ones like that I pulled for people talking about Madonna. Wow. You know, that's when it gets serious. When there's a topic like Madonna, things are going to go down. <laughs> right? That's right, baby. Yeah. <laughs>